39. When is the boiling point of a liquid equal to its normal boiling point? Okay. So, we always know about boiling points in theory, right? Especially if we're doing calculations for water, right? We always talk about water being 100 degrees Celsius. But in real life conditions, that 100 degrees Celsius might not be true for your area, right? If you live way above sea level in Colorado, your boiling point might be different from its normal boiling point. A normal boiling point, you could think of this as like a theoretical, you know, quote unquote, theoretical boiling point. Now, there's only one um, there's only one way in which a boiling point for a substance equals that theoretical or that normal boiling point. And that is if you're under standard conditions, because it's all about theory. So we're, we're dealing with standard conditions here. So we just have to go back and say, well, what was standard conditions? Well, standard pressure conditions is always one ATM. I mean, you can say 760 torr or 760 millimeters of mercury or 101.3 uh, kPa, which is my favorite radio station. <laughs> 101.3 kPa. <laughs> um, but yeah, standard conditions is always 1 atm. And that's when a normal theoretical boiling point will uh, happen. Now, if we want to put this a little bit more in depth, is that what has to be 1 atm, right? Well, since we're talking about a boiling point, boiling point is when we're going from a liquid to a gas. And the gas has the pressure. So this is what's called the vapor pressure. So it's basically when your pressure above the liquid, which is a substance's vapor pressure, is equal to 1 atm. So when the vapor pressure So we'll say pressure above liquid, because that's how things boil. It comes off the top of the surface. The vapor pressure is exactly 1 atm. And that's it for this question. <laughs> Let's just box this off in a big box and call it a video. Oh my god, what kind of box was that? Come on. Come on. There you go. Beautiful. All right. Pretty simple question. Good theory. Um, they might ask you this on a multiple choice question where they just tell you that it's a normal boiling point. So you just have to know that a normal boiling point will always have a pressure value of 1 atm. Okay. I will be talking to you later. Have an awesome day. Let's keep studying hard. And if you wouldn't mind, please hit the subscribe button to help us out in the YouTube universe to get uh, you know, this, this channel out there that, you know, cool educational videos are here for you and for them and anybody who needs it. Thank you so much. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.